This is a molecule of fat. If you need a moment to look into the eyes of your enemy, please take it now. Fat comes in a few versions, but they all look pretty similar. This little guy lives in a coconut. The colors you see are three chemical elements. The red balls are oxygen, the black ones are carbon, and the white ones are hydrogen. And when you're looking at combinations of these three elements, you can tell how much energy a molecule has based on how little red there is, how little oxygen is there in proportion to the carbon and hydrogen. This is a molecule of sugar. You see a lot more oxygen, which means that the sugar has less energy than fat. Now some molecules are even more energy dense. This is an octane molecule, which our bodies don't know how to digest, but our cars do. So your body pulls this bad boy out of the coconut that you ate, and it holds onto it until the body needs extra energy. Then it throws some oxygen at the fat, the fat breaks apart, and recombines to make two things, H2O and CO2. Our friend the coconut oil has now become 12 carbon dioxides and 12 waters. And that's it. Nothing else. There is no solid waste. The new molecules are dropped back into your blood and released through your lungs as carbon dioxide and water vapor. That butter is going in through your stomach and out through your lungs. Fat becomes air. So next time you're running up a hill, huffing and puffing to shrink some of your excess ass, just remember in your distress that you can actually say the words, my ass, with your ass.